and welcome to Challenging Reality Gaming. I am Madame Guinevere, and today we are playing the Minecraft Reality Challenge. We are playing with over 15 different mods, including our survivalist mod. I actually ended up not playing modded Minecraft 1.6.4. Instead, we are playing modded Minecraft 1.6.2 because the survivalist mod is actually not available in 1.6.4. Not yet. He doesn't want to update to 1.6.4. Instead, he's going to do a force update to 1.6. or 1.7.4. So, to begin, I actually did input a specific seed, so we did spawn near a village because it makes more sense to that you would be from a village. Otherwise, you'd be shipwrecked on an island, which I'm actually considering doing that uh, survival island challenge. If you're interested in seeing me play that. Go ahead and comment in the comments below. In the meantime, I am going to go ahead and start finding. I forgot to add Minecraft Comes Alive. It's fine. We don't have to play with Minecraft Comes Alive. I just thought it would be interesting to do so. So we do have a thirst bar that you can see up in the top right hand on the top hand of the screen. On the top left hand corner you will take note and see that there is my weight limit. And since we are playing the hardcore mode we can't chop down trees with our hands. We have to use some kind of other material. However, I can kill sheepies if I can ever find a sheepie. There's a bunch of pigs, no sheep. Where the hell are the sheep? Okay, we also have a temperature gauge that you can see in this and the on the right hand side. More sheep, no or more pigs, no sheep. Beehive. That'll be good for us later. Okay, I know that there was a blacksmith around here. I want to see if he has, my blacksmith has a little tool of some sort that he'll let me borrow. Let's see. No, but he does have a saddle. That's pretty cool. And goat ingots and an iron chest plate. I will buy the saddle from you later. You want coal. I wish I had coal. <laughs> oh god. I don't have any materials or a way to get them. Oh, I have a seed. Yay, I have seeds. Okay, let's see here. The good news is, is being in a village, it gives us plenty Oop, more seeds gives us plenty of food. Um, we can be vegetarians for a while. Let's see. I can destroy leaves. That does make sense because you can go punch a freaking tree and get leaves off the tree. So, sapling. Then beat the tree with a stick? That doesn't make any sense. I have no way of getting materials. This is gonna not go over well at all. Let's see. What can we do? Okay, music. Music. I hate this music. I am getting rid of this stupid music. Where's the music? Make the music go away! <laughs> Oh, okay, there we go. God, I hate that music. And my window's open because it's hot in my office, so you probably hear the cops going by. Someone's not be not behaving in the neighborhood. Let's see. You want three pieces of emeralds for shears. That's actually not a bad deal, comparatively speaking. If I had freaking shears! Or stuff to give you. The heck, man. Uh, 
Wait, what? Eye of Emerald. Nice. Watermelon. I will come back for you, dear. Okay, so I really should find some sheep. Otherwise, I will not survive the night. So, I also should probably get some sand. Not that I can do anything with it. By getting sand, I need three pieces of sand in order to create... Ah, uh, water's going to attack me. It's attacking me. I need three pieces of sand in order to make glass. And I need three pieces of glass, well, one sand per glass, in order for us to make a bottle, which is something that we need in order to hydrate ourselves. We need a bottle to collect water. Are those pigs over there? It's an island of only pigs. I need a stick. I need something that I can, like, beat these trees with to get, like, wood. Oh my god, this is just, like, not going to work. I am so going to die before I even get started. A mushroom. Yes. I will beat a stick with a mushroom. But I am going to get the mushroom, though. Because it's food. And the sugar cane. That is really cool. I'm actually using a special texture pack that actually randomizes the textures. So this is sugar cane. That is sugar cane. It looks like cattail. That is pretty cool. Mushrooms. Mushroom. Mushroom. Hey, I can beat I can beat the I can beat the trees with 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 um with cac with the uh, cane. Yeah, that totally makes some sense. I can totally beat a beat a tree with with cane. You make no sense, you. Shh, it's okay. I'm beating the tree with cane. Okay, I have my minimum requirement in order to make an axe, but what the hell, might as well. Right? It's not like it's going to kill my cane, which is stupid. Everything should have a durability level. Of course it doesn't, though. La la la. No, oh, I didn't mean to make three! Oh, God. So stupid. I have tools! Yay! Tools! Okie dokie. So, now, I have a sword. Where are the sheep? Alright. So now that I actually have tools, I'm going to go ahead and try and hopefully collect some stuff before I die. <laughs> oh, Lord have mercy. And I have tree compactor. Capitator, I think is how it's pronounced. It chops down the whole tree when I cut down one. Because that makes more fucking sense than floating goddamn trees in Minecraft. Sorry. It just, it irks me. And I have a map. My map tells me the village is that way, so I'm going to go this way. You know, I want some white for my floor. Eventually, maybe. Cut the stupid tree. Okay, any time now. Any time now. Thank you. Okay. Oh, I'm over encumbered. This is what I was actually hoping for. I wanted to show y'all. I am way over encumbered. So, I have to lose some load. Otherwise, I can't run. This is one of the wonderful benefits of this mod. It is awesome. And I love it. More realistic. You can't carry them. 
more than 250 items. Otherwise, guess what? You can't carry it. Bats are out. I need to go find a house and hide. House, 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 house. I can't see anything. And I just saved myself from zombies. <laughs> Except for the fact that I can't freaking see. Okay, I'm just basically demolishing and causing sacrilegious bad stuff to happen at this church here. Because, yeah, why not? Actually, my point of doing this is to, like, hide everything from... Oh, yay! We get to sit out the night. I don't hear any zombies. Let me check. Oh, okay. Right as I say I don't hear any zombies, then I start hearing zombies. Go figure. Oh, look! There they are! There's a lot of them! My whole village is gonna be dead. Dead, dead, dead. Alright. And I'm almost out of water too! I'm gonna so die. I am so gonna die. It's my first night and I'm gonna die. God. This this survival mod does not hold your hand at all. And the bad part is, is there's water right over there. Right over there. And I can't get to it. And there's water right over there too and I can't get it to it <laughs> why <laughs> oh lord let's go straight up oh oh god oh god oh god oh god oh god oh god I'm dead <laughs> Well, we failed that one! <laughs>